Kate and Charlotte wear matching coat dresses at Queen's funeral. Kate and Princess Charlotte are a sweet mother and daughter duo as they arrive at the Queen's state funeral in matching outfits. Kate opted for an elegant black ensemble as she joined senior members of the royal family to pay their respects to the Queen at Westminster Abbey. Kate's dress is an Alexander McQueen, a favorite designer of the royal. In a touching tribute to the Queen, the princess opted to wear a pair of drop earrings and triple string pearl choker that were part of Her Majesty's personal jewelry collection. The royal mother of two arrived at Westminster Abbey hand in hand with her daughter Princess Charlotte, seven, who joined her brother in walking behind their great grandmother's coffin. The beautiful Princess Charlotte was almost identical to her mother as she stepped out with her family to celebrate her great granny. The seven year old too wore a black coat dress which fell to mid length and boasted deep pleats. Both Kate and Charlotte wore black hats, Charlotte's plain and Kate's more decorative. However, Kate, like Camilla, appeared to update an archaic tradition with a more modern headpiece. Charlotte's hat boasted a sweet tie and bow at the back. She wore opaque black tights and black plimsoll shoes. The princess wore a tiny brooch pinned to her coat dress, in the shape of a horseshoe. The couple are believed to have bought the second in line along after senior palace advises them to consider letting him attend the state funeral because of the powerful symbolic message it sends. At the tender age of nine, and having just overcome the daunting prospect of starting a new school, George is now the second in line to the throne. With this in mind, aides have suggested it would be good for the public to see the young prince and is the future of the monarchy. It comes after they appeared at the funeral of Prince Philip, their great-grandfather last year, and will give them a chance to say goodbye to Her Majesty, who they affectionately called Gan Gan. It's the first time any of the Wales children have been seen in public since her death. It has been an extremely busy period for Kate, who has been supporting her husband Prince William publicly, and no doubt helping her children adjust to life without their Gan Gan. The death of their great-grandmother the Queen will be a heavy blow to Prince George Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, as they and their parents begin a new life at Adelaide Cottage in the grounds of Windsor Castle where Her Majesty spent most of the year.